Boys, quick, emergency. You need to come help save the nursery next door. He's got thousands of plants washing away. You three, get old shoes on and socks. We've got work to do. Oh, I'm a bush adventurer. This is a piece of fun. Hi guys, it's the Hodge Project and today we're going to be checking out our creek because it's really rainy. Hi everybody, yeah so we've gone from bushfires guys, threat of bushfires to flooding, haven't we Ollie? <laughs> so it's torrential rain guys and it's meant to get even worse later on in the day and really windy. So um, as you can see it's not too heavy right now but it sort of comes in waves. So we thought we'd go and show you guys the creek. It's really quite flooded. And we might have a look down the back, Ollie, because we want to see how Josh and Braden's forts have held up or and Caleb's tree house. Some of the kids have got some um, cubby houses, tree houses down the back. So we want to have a look at those. Do you think they've survived the rain? I don't know. You don't know? Here comes Dad. He's just been down the back paddock having a look. How'd you go, Dad? Yeah, pretty good. So it looks like it's, there's not a lot you can do. You'd have to put in a massive, um, you'd have to change the drainage system of the creek completely. Because mm. even them, they've spent twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 upgrading all theirs. The neighbours. Yeah, and theirs is overflowing as well. Still overflowing. Yeah, I don't think there's much you can do in this kind of weather. It's been raining for about a week, guys, and I think we've got another week of rain expected. So it's going to be interesting. All right, Ollie, should we head down and have a look? Are you going down? Yeah, Ollie's coming down to have a look. <laughs> Make sure you put your hoodie on. Yeah, put your hoodie on, you're gonna get wet. Hi Brayden. Oh, you're having breakfast, are you? What yep. have you got? Oh, what else? We've got no power, do we? We've had no power since we woke up. Doesn't it come back on? No, yet? it's not on yet. It's dark in there. So we can't have toast. I was gonna make you guys pancakes. Can't use the electric fry pan. <laughs> so what have you got? Cruskets. Cruskets. And Pingu's happy, our new puppy. Are you chewing up dad's shoe? Pingu. Hey. Nah. <laughs> Pingu. No. <laughs> Daddy wants those. <laughs> he likes chewing everything, just like any other puppy. All right, he's going to stay here because it's a bit too wet for him. So come on, let's go. Can you see it, Ollie? <laughs> let's go this way. Oh, I heard something bang. Did you hear that, Ollie? I think it was a branch falling on my little bungalow over there. It often gets little branches and sticks falling, but that sounded quite big. Oh, the wind's coming up now. Don't get too close, Ollie. So what do you think? It looks different. Yeah, so it has been like this once before, but this is only the second time we've seen it like this. So that's the creek, guys. Just show you the waterfall part down here. There's the waterfall part, Ollie. But um, used to be like a little bit of water just tipping down. Now it's that. Yeah, it used to be like a drizzle, and now look at it. it. Looks pretty cool. And it's flowing all the way down there. Normally, it's not flowing like that. You know, there's not much water in there at all. All right. Should we try and cross over up the top there? Yeah. It's not very deep, Andrew and I just did it, so it's quite safe. Okay, off you go, Ollie, be careful. Okay, he made it, my turn. So we've both got our gum boots on today. <laughs> Well, gets a bit deep there. <laughs> I made it. Okay. Should we go and check out the cubby houses? Yeah. I'll be interested to see if Josh's is still standing. I don't think we've shown you guys Josh's for a while. He's built a little fort in the woods over here. As you can see, the path is all, there's water everywhere. Puddles of water everywhere. So, oh, look, it's standing up pretty well. 
This is Josh's little hut that he made out of sticks. Um, but they used to be like all around. Have some of them fallen down, have they? Yeah. It's yeah. Oh, it's standing up pretty well, I think. So yeah, Josh made this pretty much on his own. So I was pretty impressed with him. He's put sticks and things on the top as well. As you can see, Oh, it's pretty good. You're putting some of the sticks back, Ollie. <laughs> Let's um, look at Caleb's treehouse. Oh, yeah, Caleb's treehouse is up here. We haven't shown you that yet, guys. Dad and I helped him make it just a little, very small sort of treehouse. It's a little platform for him up in the trees, but he seems to like it. The ground is just soaked, guys, everywhere. But we really needed the rain, so we can't complain. So this is Caleb's tree house. You gonna go up, Oliver? How is it? Pretty stable. Oh, that one's come down. That's okay, we can probably fix it later. This was my favorite seat. Your favorite seat. Look, he's got a little seat there. So it's just a, um, a pallet up there that we've put. So yeah, Caleb likes it. And then he's got a little section down here. I'm sure he'll show you again in another video and what he, likes to do up there but yeah it's withheld so far but we've got these big winds yet to come guys so we might have to do another update this afternoon you've got boot, uh, water in your boots have you yeah so do i So I went into my room and got changed and when I was getting changed I heard a big bash like a crack like glass smashing so I go out the front and the one of the windows that oh. we've got to renovate the front room the glass the whole thing fell over and oh, smashed no. on the ground and the glass has gone oh, everywhere. Oh that's not good. So I swore a few times because oh I thought it was the door oh, and okay. I was like, you're joking, oh. but it was just one window. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah, we had windows for our room it's we're renovating. It's only one of them. It's one of the oh, three okay. windows. Okay, so we might have a two two windows in the room or now. Or we pay 50 bucks and get a new glass. Oh yeah, new glass. Yeah, okay. Oh well, that's not too serious guys, but hopefully nothing else happens worse later so like i said the wind's meant to really come up later concerned, you worried about the wind i think we need to move your van yeah well show everyone andrew's worried about the van getting hit by a tree hey guys look at this all these dead branches hanging off the edge of this tree but there's one there and when it falls it could put a hole in the um oh no not my nursery and <laughs> Yeah, there's all these branches that they've fallen, but then they've got stuck, you know, in the other branches. So with the wind later, they might come down. So we'll see. And this see. is going to be 65 to 70 kilometer an hour gusts. Oh my gosh. Which I've personally never seen in Sydney ever. Really? No, not 70. Look at this. Uh, all the shine up here and show them all the trees around here. Show them all the trees. Yeah. Like it's surrounded by trees, your car. We've got all the biggest trees over here, right near my car. And at the, around the back there, if any of them fall. So what you do is you park on the red road or something. Uh, or you come on the grass just Oh yeah, I can park meters. on the red road. All right, well, I've got to go get bread. I'm going to do that now before the weather gets much worse. So I might move the van a little bit. How's Pingu going, Ollie? Good. Is he all right? Yeah. <laughs> Pingu, Pingu, how are you going buddy? You're looking a bit wet, <laughs> aren't you? How's that? He loves belly rubs, don't you Pingu? Hey? He's not too phased by the weather, are you buddy? No. I did mop the porch guys yesterday, but with this rain, you just can't keep the mud off it, can you? Oh hi Aaliyah, do you want to say hi to everybody? 
trying to play with you. Hi guys. What do you think of the weather, Aaliyah? Oh my oh. goodness, it's raining. I've just noticed. The power's back on. The lights are on inside. Did you know the power came back on? No. Oh, you didn't know. Oh, well, that's good. He bit me. Did he bite you? <laughs> oh, Pingu, no biting. All right, guys. Well, we'll check back in with everyone this afternoon, okay, Aaliyah? See you soon. Oh, I'm the bush adventurer. What are you doing, Brayden? Oh, I'm the bush adventurer. Oh, so he's, oh. he's not Brayden, guys. He's the bush adventurer, whoever that is. Um, this is what happens when you have bored boys in rainy this weather. This is a wild set of stairs. <laughs> got to be careful because it's all moisturized. Oh dear. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm the bush adventurer. <laughs> oh, I'm just generating some rain. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> So guys, we thought we'd go and have another check on the creek. It looks like it's coming up some more. Braden's the bush adventurer today. So I don't know what he's doing now. Lots of good bit of grass. This is what you call a wall away. <laughs> Hear that guys? A wall of leaves. <laughs> I think I'll go around this way, guys. Oh, wow. The water's coming up higher. Wow. Oh, my goodness. It's beautiful. <laughs> I'm trying to think what he looks like. He looks like a character from a show, but I can't think what it is. That is a beauty. <laughs> wow. Wow. It's come up a lot more. We're going to want to be Thanks about this. You're not going in there, bush adventurer. I will go. <laughs> you can't go in there. Come back. All right, guys, we might leave him alone for a minute. But, yeah, wow, look at this. It's really come up a lot. In just, It's been about one hour, guys, of heavy rain since we last checked. We'll just have a look down here at the waterfall area. You <laughs> going! I'm going to see the waterfall. Oh, I'm the bush adventurer. Oh dear. You follow me. <laughs> okay, sorry. Oh dear, guys. We better follow him. This is what you call water. <laughs> As you can see, that is a little. Now, that is called a water battle of death. If you get sucked into that beauty, you're dead. <laughs> oh dear. So we're not going near this waterfall, guys. It's deadly. Look at that. It's really raging now. This little bug right here is called an orange leaf. <laughs> oh, I'm the bush adventurer. It's a red rock! It's red! This is a water stick! Oh, I am 
the Bush Adventurer! That's a strong current! Embarrassed me! Yeah! Oh. 
Braden now? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna lose my voice. I'm gonna be freezing. Yeah. I'm gonna get hypothermia. Yeah. And I'm gonna get extremely embarrassed after people see this video, <laughs> obviously. And overall I shouldn't have done this video, but I was just bored. <laughs> so you're bored, we've been stuck inside with the rain. It is pouring it's like, guys. It's like sticks falling on Yeah, we need to probably move because it's getting windy. But we just wanted to show you this and Raiden wanted to give you guys a bit of entertainment. Hopefully you were entertained. 
Oh no, he, no, he's not back, is he? Or is that just your cover? That, that's just my cover. <laughs> your protection. <laughs> if I put it one centimetre more, then I'll turn back into Oh, then you'll turn back into the, what is it, the bush bush adventurer? Yep. Okay. All right. Stay well. tuned okay. for episode two, <laughs> which probably won't even come because I'll be too embarrassed. <laughs> Love the accent, Braden. All right, well, we might, oh, I just want to show over there on the other side. Yeah. Okay. And then we'll head back up and we'll check in with you guys again later this afternoon. Look at this guys, this is the nursery next door. And as you can see, the plants here are just washing away. So we've got Caleb here, we're gonna go and have a look. Daddy's just looking at the road, he's pointing over there. Yeah, there's water flowing down. Oh, Dad's calling us, come on Caleb, let's go see. Dad's up on the road. Yeah, so dad wants me to come and video something up on the road. We'll be careful. That's it. Oh, he's lost a tree branch. Oh. 50 plants as well. Oh. So this is the front of the neighbor's house, guys. You okay? This is the front of the neighbor's. So you've got all the water. If you can see over there where the white bubbles are, it's all coming from the road from under the underpass there. And it's just flooding. Look at this. And next door to us is a nursery, a wholesale nursery, and he's lost at least a hundred plants. Yeah, his plants are all floating down well, he's our creek. Lose hundreds. So we're yeah. going to get in there and try and save some. He's called the owner of next door, guys, the nursery owner, and he's coming down. He doesn't live at the property, so he's coming down, and Andrew's going to try and help him because a lot of these plants are all floating away, and that's his business. So it's not good. What do you think, Caleb? Yeah, look at it. Wow. Anyway, I'm gonna go in and start. Alright. Okay, okay. So our place and our creek is just around there, guys. This connects up to our creek over there. Wow. Alright. Do you wanna come and see our creek? You haven't seen our creek yet. Are you gonna come see it? We can't go near it though, okay, because it's very dangerous. Wow, everything's nice and green as you can see guys, but it's about, um, what's the time? I think it's about 1.30 right now in the afternoon and the weather's meant to get even worse. So we might be in for worse yet. Whoa, did you see that? <laughs> Nearly got splashed. Don't go too close to the water over there on the road because it might wet you when a car comes. <laughs> Come over this way, Caleb, stay down here. Stay down here, we'll go on the edge over here. I'm just worried about him getting splashed by a car. That's it. Okay, be careful. There's water everywhere. Wait, wouldn't I like drown in that? Where Probably. Yeah, you can't go in there, okay? Look at it, it's pretty rough, isn't it? It's actually calmed down a bit, I think, since Brayden and I were here. Oh, just a little bit. But look, all these plants over here, Caleb. They're all floating away. See the plants? Look at them over there, they're all floating. They're coming down here and then they're floating down here. Look, Dad's helping. Creek. Yeah, Dad's over there, moving some of the plants so that hopefully they don't float away. Look at all those plants. isn't it Caleb it's getting really windy now um, so it's not really safe to be out here and I'm not sure if you can see it but there's a tree across the driveway towards the back paddock I'll try and zoom in if you can see it there guys there's a tree there's a tree that's come down back there so yeah the the moisture can sort of make the trees heavy and fall down so we better move okay we'll catch up with you guys soon Boys, quick, emergency. You need to come help save the nursery next door. He's got thousands of plants washing away. You three, get old shoes on and socks. We've got work to do. It's leaking. Oh, and we have a leak in the roof. Oh dear. I think just about everyone in Sydney's gonna have a leak. What a day, Brayden. 
tell everyone what we just did. We went to the neighbours and they have loads of plants uh, that were floating away um, and we had to pick them all up and move them to safety. Yeah, so we just spent probably about two hours um, moving <laughs> all these plants. We're exhausted, but we saved a lot of plants, which is good news. Um, the rain eased off a little bit towards the end there. I don't know. I'm hoping, yeah, that no more will get washed away. We'll have to wait and see. You did a great job, Brayden. And yeah. Josh helped as well. I think Josh went inside to have a shower. So, good job. Now go and have a rest. I've just come down near the nursery, guys, to quickly show you. So, this has actually eased off a lot. This whole area over here, that was all raging water down there. And we moved plants from all behind that white line and around there. We moved them all up the side here to try and get them out of the water. Um, and then here as well, Andrew's put all these plants up here on the blocks. And then more up over there as well, I'm not sure if you can see. But yeah, like I said, this is eased right off. Over here was just like a river. So guys, this is our last update. Um, it's night, our power's still off. It's about, what time, 9 p.m. Yeah. And the creek is raging. We okay. went to dinner because the power was off and we thought that the storm was over. Oh, don't worry about it, it's fine. And then we got home, put the kids to bed, Lorna went to the shops and then, yeah, it's 9 p.m. or whatever. And then this happened, yeah. And then it's just gotten worse. And this one is double what the one earlier was yeah, almost. Yeah, it's hard to see. I'm going to get out the car. I've got my umbrella. Oh, I might so have to reverse. I've probably got to reverse back. This is getting dangerous, I think. <laughs> is it getting Holy closer? crap, it's getting worse, guys. We've got to reverse back. It's coming at us. Yeah, it's actually getting closer. Is it getting closer, yeah. really? Look, majorly. <laughs> oh, wow. Whoa. Uh, I'm let's go out. have a look, everyone. My phone's about to die, guys. It's got literally no power. going closer to us. <laughs> We've just got Josh and Brayden here. The Wait, other can I there. come? Yeah. So, it looks like the nursery's lost heaps more plants, guys. The owner next door is not going to be happy. Look, oh, here, no, the look. Here. The entire fence snapped. Oh wow, it has. The whole fence is snapped in half. I don't know if you can see that, guys. Oh no. But there was a fence along here and it's yeah it's been taken the out. the entire fence off and snapped Gee. the post in half. There wow. was a post there and it's snapped. Here's some of the plants. They're all floating. Look at these. Some of the plants that have come out of their pots. It's a bit hard to see, guys, because it's I'd so like dark. To this one. Oh. <laughs> he wants oh, to keep it. That's a good tree. Grab it. <laughs> Be careful, it's attached to the fence, the wire fence. Magnolia Little Gem, <laughs> I get it for free. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, so oh it's pretty crazy. God. We haven't so seen guys, it that crazy, have we? So guys, no. tomorrow the nursery is open <laughs> and they're all gonna come here and oh, see dear. these. Oh, and no. this is, this is guys, we're talking about $20,000 worth of plants mm. that have just been washed away. Yeah. And it's there's not, not much we can do. Hey guys, so it's the next morning. Our power is still out. My phone died last night. We've got Pingu here. We're just going down to have a look at the creek. It was crazy last night, guys. It was the worst. The weather was its worst last night about nine o'clock when we were filming in the car. Um, Andrew's down here already. Come on, let's go. Um, so we'll just go and have a look. The water's receded now. Um, so the creek's only flowing a little bit but you can better see the damage to the nursery. I'll just show you over here. So on this black plastic, guys, this was all plant. You can see a few left there, but yeah, the water last night, it was all here. It just washed it all away. It washed a lot of it away. So our creek is full of plants. We're gonna have to go and try and fish some of them out, I think. We'll go and have a look. And look guys, this is the fence here. The fence has all been destroyed here. So this is, you can see the fence is intact there. And then here, the water has just come across. So the water was all the way right up here, guys. I'll just move back so you can see. All these plants have been left along the edge. The water was flowing all the way out to here last night. So, what are you doing? Are you playing with trees? <laughs> He's loving having a walk around. It's been raining since we brought him home. So 
this is he hasn't been out much but he loves being outside we came down here with him a little while ago as well hi hi yeah so we checked it out this morning but my phone was dead i've just charged it in andrew's car so there's the fence guys and as you can see there's no more water here now but we've got all these plants left over. We did manage to save quite a few of them yesterday. I'll come up here and show you. Look at this, guys. You've got plants all leaning up against. Oh, you can't get over. You stuck. My phone died again, guys. So we're down the back now. We took the dog back because Andrew's got the chainsaw out because look what fell down right across the path up to the back paddock. Is your chainsaw not working? Oh, I'm just cleaning it. Oh, okay. So Andrew's gonna move this out of the way. I think that's the only tree really that fell, isn't it? On the whole property. Yeah, but there's heaps of other stuff I have to clean up anyway with the saw. Yeah. Lots of other stumps I'll do quickly. Okay. And it looks like I have to go and cut down a tree in the nursery too. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. So I'll give them a hand for an hour. Yeah. <laughs> so I've got chainsawing all day. <laughs> oh. And bobcat. Yeah. Oh, well, it could have been worse. We got off okay. There's houses all over Sydney are flooded and there was flash flooding everywhere, wasn't there? Yeah. And mum was freaking out um, because tell everyone what happened nearby. Oh, yeah, a car got taken away but where, where there's a waterfall. Yeah, there's a waterfall nearby um, and I'd been shopping last night and I was going to message mum when I got home to tell her I got home safely, but my phone died so I couldn't message her. And then mum's heard on the news that a car got washed away in our suburb and so she was freaking out all night so she called me this morning crying like I, I managed to call her from Andrew's phone and yeah she was so upset she yeah so yeah poor <laughs> mum anyway it wasn't me so it was okay but yeah it's been the craziest um weather of this kind apparently for 30 years I think mm. that's what they said on the news yeah so pretty crazy stuff I'll show you a bit more of the nursery later because I think the owner's over there now clearing it up a bit um so yeah we'll check in with you guys soon see you guys it's the next morning guys we've had no power for four days and we finally have power isn't it great i can finally do the washing guys that's my main thing i have such a big backup of washing to do and uh, no more takeaway we can have a hot homemade meal is that good yeah all right so we're going to finish up the video here it's been a very crazy few days some of the kids are still asleep okay but we'll go wake them up and get them ready for school if you've had flooding over the last few days let us know over on facebook what's been happening with you thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video bye guys